growing up, I was always uh, really involved in, in politics and history and stuff. And so when I when I opened my call and I saw uh, the, the the letters DC on it, um, I just got super excited because <laughs> um, there's there's everything out there. Um, just as far as a place to go, you have DC right there. You have museums and battlefields from the Civil War, and there's just so much out there. Um, and as I as I got out there too, um, I got to meet the people out there, um, and it just it just became such a. Uh, it, it was one of those things where, from the minute I opened my call, it, it kind of felt like home. Um, it just it just seemed like the right thing, and uh, so yeah, excitement, uh, anticipation. As far as, as far as preparation goes, um, I tried to, as I was getting closer, I wanted to try and live uh, a little bit like a missionary. So I started waking up a little bit earlier. Um, I, I really emphasize getting in a good scripture study every day. Um, and I tried to go to the temple a lot, really take advantage of uh, of the, the spiritual opportunities that we have every day. I just really made sure I was going through those. One of the things that I think blessed me the most in my preparation was really learning and understanding the uh, the doctrines of the gospel um, and, and you know one of the biggest blessings and one of the things I wish I'd done more just one of those things where you always feel like you could do more um, yeah, when you're in the MTC they'll they'll teach you how to teach and you know, people say all the time I wish I'd read preach my gospel more uh, what I wish I'd read was the lessons and preach my gospel more um, I spent some time thumbing through the pages about how to teach and stuff, and they go over that in the MTC. But I wish I'd known uh, the order of the lessons and the, the way that the doctrines are presented so that I could have been more familiar with that.